you are one hallelujah away from your breakthrough. Don't quit. You're one thank you Jesus away from your promotion. Don't quit. Oh, you're one glory be to God away from your next level. Don't quit. You're one bless your holy name away from God simply blowing your mind. Don't quit. Good morning and welcome back to your spiritual sports segment on Rima Gospel Radio. Better than when you heard it yesterday. I'm CJ. Let go. The National Basketball Association was bowling last night as the first round of the playoffs rolled on with two games in the Eastern Conference and one in the Western Conference. As the Bolton Celtics was without Rajon Rondo against the Atlanta Hawks, but Paul Pierce said, I got this, and lit up the scoreboard with 36 points and pulled down 14 rebounds as the Celtics clipped the wings on the Atlanta Hawks to even the series 1-0. The Philadelphia 76ers crushed the Derek Rose-less Chicago Bulls, 109-92, as Drew Holiday poured in 26 points. And the Denver Nuggets lost against the LA Lakers, 104-100, to after the Lakers held a comfortable lead as Kobe Bryant was hot with 38 points, while Paul Gasol had a double-double, and Andrew Bynum had a playoff career high of 27 points. There was only one game skating on the ice last night in the National Hockey League in the Eastern Conference as the New Jersey Devils dominated the Philadelphia Flyers 4-1 to tie the series 1-all as Danius Subras had two assists. Major League Baseball had plenty of bats swinging last night with 15 games on the diamond as the Kansas City Roars was demolished by the Detroit Tigers 9-3 with two RBIs from Austin Jackson. The Baltimore Orioles blasted the New York Yankees 7-1 as manager Buck Showater earned his 1,000th win. The Texas Rangers lost by one run to the Toronto Blue Jays 8-7 as Jose Baptista launched a home run. The Oakland A's defeated the Boston Red Sox 5-3 as Jamil Weeks provided two RBIs, while the Seattle Mariners couldn't handle the Tampa Bay Rays and lost 3-1 with a home run from Matt Joyce. The Cleveland Indians were punished by the Chicago White Sox 7-2 as Gordon Beckham launched a home run and notched two RBIs, and the Minnesota Twins were shut out by the LA Angels 4-0 as Jerome in the house, Williams threw a three-hitter to wrap up scores in the American League. And stay tuned for the second round of scores in the National League. For your quick Summer Olympics news and notes, 26-year-old Dale Owen, one of Norway's biggest medal hopes in swimming for the London Olympics, passed away suddenly from cardiac arrest during a pre-Olympic training camp in Flagstaff, Arizona after collapsing in his bathroom. May God rest his soul and bring comfort to his family, friends, and teammates. McDonald's is a sponsor for the London Olympics and the British Doctors Group says that sending the wrong message in a country with ballooning obesity. And finally, London residents are getting troops and surface to air missiles on their rooftops for the Summer Olympics as British security officials identify potential sites on Monday and announce plans for security tests during the week. Whatever happened to the good old days? And in late breaking news last night, a person with knowledge of the award says New York Knicks center Tyson Chandler has been voted the NBA's Defensive Player of the Year. To you have your company sponsor a sports segment, please email me at cjsports, that's C-E-E-J-A-Y, sports at gmail.com for more information. To catch archives of your spiritual sports segment, log on to my brand new blog site, cjsports.com. And be sure to follow me on Twitter, at cjsports. And stay tuned for more updates in your next spiritual sports segment, where we sprinkle a little spirituality <laughs> in your sports. I'm CJ. Be blessed and keep smiling because God has something special in store for you. And in closing, as justice is beginning to take shape, I am still Trayvon Martin. <laughs>